I am Chris Hoke. I'm Richard Hoke. And we are reviewing games, young and old, consoles, stuff, all kinds of video game stuff. No relation, by the way. Oh, no, yes. What do you have today? Today I have Army of Two Devil's Cartel. Now, is this the third? This is series? the third of the series, unless you count the P- PSP version, which was terrible. No, we don't ever count the handhelds. Uh, the third. I played Army of Two one, the first one, and yeah. I liked it. I did. I totally missed the second one somehow. The second one wasn't really big because people liked the first one, but not as much as people liked other games at the time. Like Call of yeah. Duty was coming out and all that. Um, but, well, I remember about this. The, the first one was you could customize your weapon and you could customize your like your yes. your face mask, your you body could, armor. You can do that. Stuff. These two. You can do it in the other two also. Yeah. The second one brought out the camo on the guns and stuff. You don't, no longer you don't have to go with just gold. It'll be different colors. Like snake skin, stuff like that. Yeah, for a call, like, you really could, like, uh, it, you could customize your different. weapons. You customize your weapons more so than Call of Duty in any other game. True slash false. I mean, okay. they're different. Call of Duty's not meant for the customization of the guns. Okay. They're mainly, for, well, maybe now, but. Well, GTA Five, you can do some stuff too. Or that's GTA Five. Everybody loves that. Just had to give something back. Anyway, right. show them the squeaky controller right quick. Oh yes, I got. Uh, While well, I was at AIT, I bought this Xbox and TV, and I got this controller. I got two of them. It's a third party controller. It is a third party, so if you don't like third parties, don't get it. I generally don't like third parties, but this is an Afterglow controller. It lights up. It. It also. Uh, I mean, I can shut it off. It can light up. Do you get lit. different colors? Um, yes, sir. They had blue, green, and I think pink or purple. I'm not sure how many colors they got, though, because I don't... I'm more of a... I like the actual brand Xbox. Yeah, same here. I don't like third parties. Back to the game. Army yes. of Two... Devil's Cartel. Devil's Cartel. What's good about it? Well, they did it differently than the past two. The other two, when you went to overkill mode, it was slow. Like, very slow. It wasn't fast pace. This one's way faster. Everything's faster. Okay. It took it up to the speed. Like the second one brought it up a little faster than the first. Mm-hmm. And then this one just took it up all the way. Okay. When you do overkill mode, everything is still very like explosive, unlimited ammo, all that. Right. But they made it fast paced real life based. Okay. So like or should I say real time speed. Time. Okay. And uh, you sh- shoot and everything like that, explosive rounds, unlimited bombs, clip type thing. You don't have to reload. Is there a lot of physics in the game? Yes, you can blow up walls and blow up uh, barrels and buildings and trucks and stuff. Well, see, one thing I love about it really yeah. kind of started, <coughs> I mean, they kind of could do it with PS2 in that generation. I guess it would be Xbox. The, the first Xbox, you can't say Xbox One anymore. First yeah. Xbox, the first Xbox. And then PS2, that generation had a little bit of physics, mm-hmm. and then three and 360 had more physics, and I can only assume that the PS4 four and the and Xbox one, one, they're outrageous on the physics now. It's I love cool. physics in video games. Then you would love the Xbox One and PS4, because the graphics and everything, they upped it, and they have the physics part. So physics is represented well in Army of Two Devils. Yes, Cartel. in this game, they are actually doing a really good job with the physics and then they're going to make another one I think if you're a novice to what that means physics basically means how things interact with the environment so if basically I, if I were to shoot a wall it would actually show that sh- shot yeah you see destruction and you would see the wall kind of just like crumble and stuff or if a building explodes you know or a car explodes the building is affected uh, just basic physics I'll, I'll do a battlefield video one day yeah that's what physics is about and so, then you'll see what physics is really about army of two devil's cartel Buy it, yes or no? I would say now, sure, why don't you go ahead and give it a buy? Yeah. I would give it a buy, just to see what the difference is from the other ones. If you're into the series. If you're not into the series, then stick with whatever you do. So but this is a, this is a, it really is good if you're a fan of Army of Two. If you like Army of Two, you would like this game. Or if you like the EA, EA made this one. The past ones were made by EA, but EA up their stuff. Mm-hmm. And when this game came out, the physics and all that were introduced really well. Good. Because EA made EA does a really good job with their things, like Battlefield, stuff like that. Cool. Um, <coughs> so it's a buy if you're a fan. And cool. I guess... I'll Show them a quick deal um, with your fancy 
third party controller. I'll have it lit up then because that way it's like, oh, it's magic. Yay. And now it's. It's probably going to be doing a cutscene, so. Oh my god. This gameplay is not going to be. Oh my god. Yeah, you're in Mexico, by the way, in this one. So we got to wait for the cutscene? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, so I'll, I'll just tell you what. Just, the gameplay won't matter. You can look it up on YouTube. <laughs> I really, it doesn't really matter. If you like the game, get it. If you don't, then I don't know what to tell you. I would look it up on YouTube. Look it up on YouTube. Look up some gameplay. <laughs> that is like the most strangest recommendation of all time. I'm going to recommend that you go on YouTube. I, I recommend you get it if you don't like it. Just I'll, I can help you. That's awesome. I can't really help you if you don't like it. Because, I mean... You're on your own. You're on your own. <laughs> and with that, I guess... You have enough resources. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, there you go. Video game review. Yeah. <laughs> or me oh, too. the cool thing about this one, Oh, too, we have more. Yes, yeah, so the, the cool thing about this one is once you beat the game, you get all the... Uh, you do, you get the outfit, and you get the masks of the classic Rios and Salem, if you're into the series. Mm -hmm. You would like it, because once you beat the game, you get their masks. And you can buy them, or you get them for free. I don't know how it works again. It's been a while. It came out in, like, 2012. Games, all the new. Video game review.